Hi, this is Owen and Owen is a pug cross. Um, he's got a short coat and most people seem to think that short coated dogs can just be abandoned and they don't need to have any coat care at all and nothing really could be further from the truth. Each dog's got a number of hairs that are going to be dropping out on any one day so it's important that you take all of those hairs out and pull them right out of the coat before they cause any itchy sort of skin issues for the dog. So the tools I'm going to use are a, um, a flexible rubber curry comb and that will help to massage the skin. Also very good to use this in the bath. I'm going to use a grooming mitt which will take the hairs that I have pulled out and loosened off the coat and then finally I'm going to go through with a very fine tooth comb which will remove all those final last little loose hairs. So we're going to start with a fairly brisk motion which is massaging the dog and loosening up all of those hairs. <laughs> Sometimes you find a good spot. Isn't that nice? I'm going to switch now to the grooming mitt and stroke the dog and pull those hairs off that I have just loosened up. And then finally, <laughs> I'm going to go in with the comb. Little bits of hair coming off you, sweetie. So whatever you groom out of your dog, you're not going to be vacuuming. Is that nice? And if you take a look at that, there's quite a lot of fur comes out in that comb. <laughs> it's very interesting, isn't it, sweetie? <laughs> Now, if you do have a wriggly dog, you can, Owen, what's that? Bribe him to stay still with some treats. Or you can tie him up, but I would prefer that the dog learns with a piece of food firmly in your hand so he can't actually get it to stand still. So you can take little nibble little bits off gently. And you can continue combing the dog like that. There's a good boy.